Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. 안녕하세요, 다우드킴입니다. Finally, 2020 Ramadan is coming. Yay, 박수. Uh, so I also preparing Ramadan now. There are not many preparing things, but you know, mindset is Ramadan. <laughs> So this will be your first fasting and Ramadan as a Muslim. I'm so, so excited. You know that Ramadan is so much important to Muslim. You can see in Quran 2.185, the month of Ramadan in which was revealed the Quran or guardians for the people and clear proof of guardians and criterion. You can serve Allah and close Allah's mouth to Allah and you can endure your desire and make you live fresh and be clean. Your sins are gone and also we can do charity for poor people. You can be blessed a lot in Ramadan. So today I prepared a special video for Ramadan 2020 how to get my mindset uh, in front of the Ramadan. It's named 5 Ramadan tips for success. So we're gonna watch it together. I'm so excited. Okay, let's go. I love this nasty. It's good. Oh. Number one, don't eat or drink too much. <laughs> Eating too much is a common mistake made by many who fast during Ramadan. That's Once me. it's time to eat, we eat and drink like there's no tomorrow, overloading our stomachs until it's difficult to move. This then makes us lazy and unproductive. Right. Keep in mind, that Ramadan is about self-control, not self-indulgence. Oh, yeah. So let's try to stick to the prophetic rule on eating. Fill our stomachs with one-third food, one-third water, and one-third breathing space, inshallah. Okay, inshallah. Number two, give daily charity. Charity, important. The Prophet Muhammad, peace and blessings be upon him, was upon always him. generous, but even more so during the month of Ramadan. The rewards for charity are increased so much during Ramadan that we strongly advise everyone who can to donate a little amount every single day during Ramadan. The reward will be multiplied many times. This way you can also guarantee your donation is on Layat al-Qadr, the night of power. A person who donates only 10 pounds on Layat al-Qadr will have the reward of donating 300,000 wow. pounds of charity. That's a lot. Subhanallah. Don't Subhanallah. miss out. Don't Number miss out. three, pray five times a day. Oh, pray, pray. During the month of Ramadan, you will find the masjids completely packed out during Tarawih prayers, which is amazing. But then, during the five daily prayers, you will notice the masjids are nowhere near as packed. Unfortunately, many people have mixed up their priorities. The Fard, Obligatory five daily prayers have been put below the Sunnah Tarawih prayers. Although nobody can deny the importance of the Tarawih prayers, which comes with an abundance of rewards and blessings, the five daily prayers will always be greater and above all the Sunnah or optional prayers. So please do not neglect your obligations this month. Okay. Number four, Base month of the Quran. Quran. During Ramadan, many Muslims try to finish the Qur'an as fast as possible. Some people finish reciting it two, three, or even five times. Five times. Subhanallah, as though it's a speeding competition. It is recited without any understanding or contemplation. Although there is always benefit in reciting the verses of the Qur'an, there is a greater benefit in reciting with understanding because the purpose of the Qur'an is to guide mankind. And how can we be guided if we don't take time to understand the verses? So make this the month you truly connect with the Qur'an. Number five, attain taqwa, God consciousness. The Qur'an prescribes fasting for the believers in these words. O oh, you who have believed, decreed upon you is fasting as it was decreed upon those before you, so that you may attain taqwa. Hence, the intent and effect of fasting, as described in this verse, is to acquire taqwa. Presence of taqwa helps protect a believer from committing sins and to overcome the nafs desires. There is no equivalent English word for taqwa. In Islamic terminology, taqwa refers to a state of consciousness where one constantly feels the presence of his Creator, 
obeys his commands to attain his pleasure and avoids disobedience to him, not only out of his fear, but also for the love of him. These are just five tips from the Merciful Servant team, wishing you all a very blessed Ramadan. Please share these tips with your friends and family and let us know if you want to see more top 5 videos this Ramadan. Okay. Share to family. <laughs> My family is not Muslim. <laughs> but I can try. <laughs> like, oh, you know, in also Christianity, fasting is recommended. So can we do it together? Like like this maybe okay so this video was wow so amazing so amazing wow it's a really good tip like they say many people already know but many people also don't notice usually don't need too much obviously and <laughs> a mandatory prayer and do more charity and also quran yes i really agree this point like many people try to quran very fast like two times three times but even if they don't understand the meaning of the quran then that is useless right wow these tips very good. And I want to say one thing. This year Ramadan is not normal, right? Masjid is all closed now. Maybe it would be a little bit more hard, but I think this is also message of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. You know, like this is the world pandemic. Many people are suffering from this, but this is the perfect timing to help each other and make our community more strong and have more blessed. I'm sure that this Ramadan would be a really amazing and beautiful journey of my life. I'm sure about this. Actually, I'm, I'm really excited. You know, like fasting is not easy. Of course, I know I already tried last year, but, but the feelings in Ramadan is so amazing, you know, right? Fasting together all over the world, brothers, sisters, pray hard, read Quran hard, be close to Allah, subhanahu wa ta'ala. And, and we can also follow the Sunnah Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam. So I'm excited. I'm done today. I hope you guys also prepare well this Ramadan 2020. Thank you for watching my video. Take care and be safe. Alhamdulillah. Maasalama. 감사합니다. 안녕.